You boot up Stardew Valley, you pick a name, a farm name, choose some drip for your character, choose a pet, and then you don't choose your farm. You just don't get one. Why would you do that? That removes a major aspect of the game, the farming skill. Because I want to. I have to spend the next year homeless in Stardew Valley. And I got a couple of goals. My goals consist of, let's make 250,000 gold, make some friends, unlock farming. Yes, that's possible. And the ultimate goal of unlocking a house so I finally have somewhere to live. Oh yeah, this video is long as hell, so I provided timestamps for all the different seasons. And if you're short on time right now, just kind of treat them as separate videos. So watch like spring and then summer and then fall etc. But before I manage to accomplish all of that, we have to start here. There is so much stuff I want to get done, I could not tell you at all if I wanted to. But the first thing we need to do is grab our fishing rod since I want to catch all the spring fish I can catch possibly. Now there are a lot of fish that overlap with other seasons so you can catch them in like spring, summer, and fall. But honestly I'd like to just get it out of the way so I do not forget. Alright, the first fish is down, very nice. And the next one is down. The sardine is like laughably easy to catch, but I figured, hey, it's easy. May as well get it off my plate right away. The next fish I want, I can't catch until uh, 4 p.m. So I'm just gonna go off and start working on making a little bit of money. Oh yeah, another goal I really wanna work on right now is getting the trash can me, out, which will just like upgrade the house and then abandon my wife in there. Ethics aside, that's not the concern. I would do it. It's like, should I be allowed to even interact with my house? Since I guess it technically does give me a benefit since like spouses can send you items. But uh, I think I want to do it, so I'm probably gonna do it. But I guess Leah could just hate me and not want to date me. So I guess that is also a possibility. Leah just arrived and I'm going to buy her a salad and hopefully start working on being her friend, I guess. Leah is absolutely a W spouse. Definitely my favorite. Haley, your favorite? Just seek out, man. That's all I'm gonna say, okay? I forgot to bring energy food like an idiot, so I can't chop that many trees, but I did find a forageable that is spring exclusive that I did not think I would find, so that is a nice surprise. Ooh, I'm very glad I saved my fish because I get 25% more it for literally free. I will sell all these today. I caught it pretty damn easily. It was not even a little bit of a problem. Also caught a couple more fish that were super easy and I figured I may as well just donate them now. So boom, we actually made a pretty damn good progress on the fishing bundle. Wasted a ton of money on getting bait, but I think it's gonna be worth it. I'll make it back. It's only like 5G per cast and like I make money back on that even if it's like literally seaweed, so I should not be complaining. I really want to get to Krobus since there's a legendary fish down there. So I'm going to donate all these artifacts I just found. Yes, even the diamond because I fished it up. So it's basically just like no gain, no loss if I just donate it right away. It's like it never exists. It's basically like it never existed. And we get a scary rare crow for that that I will make my new friend. My little rare crow friend is going to sit right here and he is going to be named uh, Jeff. And that's Michael over there. Not sure why I chose the most basic names imaginable, but Jeff and Michael are actually very good friends. Another lost book. I freaking love lost books, dude. Also, this chick needs a fish. The quests are actually relatively fun to do, and I got another one in the mines, and I was gonna go mining anyway, so... Let's go kill a child. My bad, a squid kid. I was close. I think they spawn pretty far down, so I'll just do a run-through on these floors. Oh, an infested floor. That's actually perfect here is the child child down awesome really i have to run all the way over to the wizard that's kind of annoying i'm not gonna lie to you unfortunately the wizard is not chill like that thankfully the wizard is not closed up shop and he gives me 350 gold let's freaking go these slimes are actually getting dangerously close to killing wait 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 am i trolling am i pretending oh my god Wait, 8 HP, not even close. I am very glad I didn't die. That would have been very embarrassing. I'm gonna plant this mahogany seed in a very safe place. Cause I think I said last time I was gonna like sell my hardwood or something stupid like that. Also I didn't have boots on. That's probably why I almost died. But I'm gonna keep it. Cause I'm gonna go to Ginger Island, man. And that takes a lot of hardwood. Day one of spring. I mean, summer, my bad. All right, objective one. Let's find all these forageables if we can. First one was pretty easy right next to where I spawned. Nothing but a squirrel over here, it seems. Oh, well, he's making the run for it. Probably scared of me. I don't blame him. We got number two tucked away trying to hide from me. Oh, I don't need you guys. I already got you. Also don't need you, man. Holy smokes. Can I please get a grape challenge? This game does a little trolling. I cannot find a grape anywhere. 
Oh my god, I can't find a pufferfish though, what the heck? That's a community center item, he's also cute as hell. Not quite a trash can hat, but I would argue he's even better. I mean, just look at him. Thankfully, I still lots of stuff to donate. I almost did not have enough bundles to make that editing thing work. That would have been very embarrassing, not gonna lie. But now I have these actually busted foods. That's a crazy amount of energy for Skull Cavern or something. Gonna hang on to those. Also get plus two defense. That is very nice. I'm feeling hyper productive. I'm not gonna lie. That was so many things I donated. I kind of want to make up with Linus, but I have literally nothing to give to him. So we'll have to do that some other time. Just, just no, no more hard feelings, Ben, okay? He won't even look at me, dude. He's so mad. Why is the game being so nice to me now? I literally needed a weapon so bad and now I have duplicates, man. They don't actually sell for that much money. That's a little bit sad, but I guess I'll take any bit of extra money I can get. Okay, the game is being too nice to me. I'm scared, dude. What is it gonna do to me? This is literally the best weapon you can get before the galaxy sword. Some might even argue it's better than the galaxy sword. Is it just gonna give me like terrible fishing luck? What's the catch, man? I guess if you just farm enough gold, you're, you're bound to get one all of a sudden. Kind of crazy, not gonna lie. But like, look at how fast I kill these mobs, man. They actually get melted. Crazy that I got this weapon, I'm telling you. Oh, and like an idiot, can't have too many good things. I accidentally exhausted myself. That's fine. Uh, I guess 25% more wood is probably nice. I guess it'd be nice if I was like planting a ton of forageables, but I'm not. So 25% more wood. It's not even nine o'clock. I'm about to go on a bank run and get so much money. And I caught all the community center fishes I could. I was right, we made a bag and a half. That is 8,357 G made after all that stuff. We still have this stuff to sell. I did upgrade my ax to iron, so we are down 5k. It was more like 13k, but hey, we gotta upgrade the ax eventually. It's kind of annoying chair bugging in, even though it takes like two seconds. Only one new artifact though. I think I gotta be starting to get those Omni Geo to get anything new. Couple more bundles on the way to being completed. Feels good, man, I tell ya. Yep, I'm doing exactly what you think I'm doing. With only level 5 fishing and a fiberglass pole. This is either gonna go terribly, terribly wrong or amazingly, amazingly well. See you on the other side, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, um... This is worth 5,000 gold. Oh, I miss it by literally seconds. That is so unfortunate. I am selling the hell out of that treasure chest tomorrow, bro. 5,000 gold. Yeah, I'm on board, man. I'm gonna start spending money I don't have and buy a fortune of salads. 10 should be good. Leah will be mine by the end of this, I swear to God. Honestly, this is less money than I thought I would get for these, but I may as well sell them. Also, this Obsidian's Edge and Lead Rock can go since the hammer does more damage than both of them. Got that donated, so I get 30 seeds. And someone very smartly recommended in the comments of the last video that I should be making tea saplings and not just selling the seeds raw. So I'm gonna work on that. Caroline doesn't really like that much stuff. What does she like? She doesn't mind daffodils, so I'm gonna grab some daffodils and try to make friends with her. Oh, I headed back to my farm very briefly, and now Demetrius is talking to me. What does he want? Oh, he wants me to side the cave. Bats is definitely more useful here since I need some community center stuff. Oh my god, okay. We hit fishing level 10, and I literally don't care. I'm going to bed right now. We did it. Fish are worth 50% more. This is huge. Okay, let's go get all my fish and make so much money. It's not even going to be funny. All right, we got the first load and a chest because I want to sell them all at once. Not have to wait and like run all the way back up. So we'll see you when it's all down there. All right, I'm going to count all of these fish up in post and see how many we have. But right now, I don't want to do that. So let's get selling. Okay, just a casual 56k. That's pretty good. Top total earnings, six figures. Let's go. Honestly, I'm happy. I was worried I'd only make like like 12k. Oh yeah, I haven't been just fishing the past couple of days. I also chopped down every single tree in Cinder Sap Forest. <laughs> We did some very nice wood cutting gaming. We got, what's that? Almost a thousand wood. We chopped down literally every single tree. We've chopped down. Okay, wait, there's more? Oh my God. Okay, give me a minute. 
Okay, we did some big wood cutting gaming. <laughs> and now we've cut down every single tree. Replanted them all, as well as a bunch on the station. So I'm gonna work on replanting all of these because we are working on the foraging 10 grind. It's gonna take a while because trees really do not give very much. So I shouldn't plant like that because I'm gonna have to knock all the wood into the water and that's stupid. Okay, all the trees are planted. Let's go talk to Leah. This was a very productive day. I think we got a ton of foraging XP. We got a ton of wood. Don't really know where we're gonna use it for i guess we can maybe i guess we can maybe use all the wooden fiber i got to like make tea saplings but i haven't even started to make friends with caroline so probably gonna have to work on that god i am terrible at making friends in this game i just completely ignore them and i probably need to work on that okay i hope robin is in here because i want to give back her axe it's kind of annoying to have to remember and carry around and whatnot uh she's not man went to the luau got a perfect score because of my very nice super cucumber I camped on the festival ground, so I returned home. Oh, it's the luau. Oh god, I need to get something nice. I probably have something that'll get the best response. I'm gonna check the wiki really quick. I think a gold super cucumber will do. So I'm gonna grab that and head down. Honestly, it doesn't look super appetizing, but maybe it is. Who, who knows, I guess. Do I need this starfruit or anything? I'm just kind of thinking to myself. Okay, yeah, I, I, I don't think so. Whatever, I'm just gonna put this in. Boom, hopefully we'll get a good response. I'm just gonna talk to everyone to raise friendship a little. It's not gonna do that much. Let's see. Oh wait, I have to talk to Lewis. Whoopsies. Okie dokie, does he like it? We all put high quality ingredients? Yep, I did. Does he like it? Does he like it? Let's see, let's see. Oh, he's excited. It's the best soup he's ever tasted. Let's go. <sighs> soup was out of this world. Let's go. Hopefully everyone will love me for that. Oh yeah. Leah's up to two hearts. I can get into her room now. Let's go. I built a path down to the traveling cart because I wanted to. Okay, I'm also gonna path everything up because I walk slightly faster on paths. I'm just gonna find a nice can path. Yeah, I like that. Okay, nice. I'm pretty sure it's like a 0.1 boost, but uh, I, I don't know, man. I, I want to do it, so I'm, I'm doing it. Also, I don't really think I need wood for that much. Like, I kind of do, but I got 400 cent at home. Also, come on, give me something good. Yeah, I don't really need any of this, to be honest. And I think I might have gotten a meteorite. Okay, so I kind of want to buy the greenhouse. That would erase all of my community center progress. But honestly, I think it might be worth it because if I buy the greenhouse and then go back to my farm, Evelyn will give me a garden pot and the recipe for a garden pot, which will let me start farming, which I very much want to do. In preparation of that, let's make a couple of recycling machines. We can also smelt up uh any quartz we have also wow i placed this mahogany tree in a terrible location all the hardware is gonna fall in that is so sad i don't want these to get broken because they're kind of expensive so i'm gonna put them in here where i know for a fact they will be safe all right joja i'm um, sorry 5k gold that is a bargain thank you very much all my trees are still growing gotta wait to harvest those i'm looking forward to that definitely okay i'm being like kind of sarcastic and kind of serious like it's gonna be kind of annoying but it's, it's, it's not gonna be that bad i guess wait i just realized i was gonna buy the vault bundle before the greenhouse oh god i have a big decision to make what do i do i genuinely can't decide the community center will be open until one so i have a while to decide the thing is i only have enough money for one of them the thing is i think it is cheaper to buy it from joja and the only bundle i really want is the one that gives me a crystallarium so i think i might just buy the crystallarium one but the thing is that one's the most expensive it's thirty thousand gold I wanna, i'm gonna have to farm up a bunch more money after which might be a little bit annoying but i guess i got nothing but time so maybe i should and i perfectly caught leah all right i think it's just way too stupid to pass up the chance to get a free crystallarium so negative 25k okay it was only 25k not 30k that's actually not that bad i i can live with 25k because i think that's only like 6k so i might actually just be able to like go to the mines and farm up enough money so i think that's what i'm gonna do then tomorrow if i remember correctly i'm gonna double check right now the greenhouse is only 30k let's see though Ooh, it's 35 so i'm gonna need 10k that's honestly not that bad. I, I can farm that up. It's gonna take a little bit, but I can do it for sure. Dude, I didn't realize how much stuff I'm just gonna need money for. Like, I'm gonna have to 
buy batteries from the traveling cart at 2500 a pop, which is just completely absurd. That is a actual highway robbery. But I guess once we start planting crops, it'll be better because I think they can grow year round. I'm going to place them in there, which is why some people suggested I move my setup in there, but I want to have room for garden pots, so I have not. Also, I am definitely going to put this crystal arum in a safe place with a diamond inside of it because I need money more than I need staircases right now. Will this make me back my 25k? I actually need it. I'm, I'm going to do the math. Screw it. Okay, I will not make my money back. Wow, I've made so many blunders today. I do not think I should have bought that crystallarium. That was so not worth it. Okay, I changed my mind. If it's gonna make like no money, honestly, I'd rather just have Jade for when I go to Skull Cavern. So give me my diamond back and go in there, Jade. Right, we got like four hours. Let's farm up as much gold and whatever as we can. Oh yeah, I've also been saving up a ton of stuff. I got a couple diamonds while I was mining yesterday. Smelted up some gold. We're gonna open all these up, hopefully donate, and get to the sewers, because I want to get there real bad so I can reset my skills. Because honestly, getting this was a mistake. I wish I'd made it so I got more ores. <laughs> Lots of new donos. Very nice. Bunch of random junk I will never use, but I'll take it anyways, because it's cool. Okay. Literally all we need is money. I want to upgrade my axe to gold, <laughs> but I shouldn't because I need to make 7k more gold. So... I can buy <laughs> the greenhouse and make more gold. It's all about the money, man, I'm telling you. Put down a couple paths so I can go faster. And I don't really feel like fishing for money, so I'm gonna go reset floors and make money. I've decided I will ruin the natural beauty of this landscape with wooden paths. Cause I'm just, I'm, I'm that guy. Kinda raining, kinda dreary today. Not sure what I should do. I'm just gonna kinda check up across the map and see if anything awesome is happening. And then I'm going to check at the Adventurer's Guild to see how many dust sprites I have left. Decide if I have it in me to farm them. And then I uh, go from there. These trees are not even close to grown, which is very sad because I really want to level up my foraging. Because there is one that makes it so I get hardwood from literally every single thing I break. And by thing, I mean tree. Not sure why I couldn't think of the word tree. Kind of an L for me. Oh, I know what I should do. I'm going to go look at the fruit back cave in my farm, which, yeah, I'm going to use. Screw you. Mm. Actually, wait, no. I'm a little conflicted if I should use it or not. I'm going to decide if they're based on the fact that there's anything good in there, <laughs> but I probably won't. Oh my god, it's all so good, but I won't. We're just gonna let it build up. Sorry I was so confrontational, guys. The people who were saying that I shouldn't use it were probably right, which was me, because I'm always right. That's why it's Wally Gug and not Lally Gug. Oh, Leah cutscene, let's go. Come on in. I mean, it's raining, so it'd be kind of rude if you made me stay out, but I digress, I'm being pedantic. It's working on the sculpture. Come here, watch this. Holy smokes, she's going off. Wish that statue was me. Just kidding, I, I don't know why I said that. Really, the essence of the wood. Interesting. Once you get past the outer layers, the true nature starts to show. It's the same with the people. I actually just prefer the look of the raw, unadulterated, creepy. <laughs> Dude, that always gets me. Bracket, creepy, bracket. May I have a kiss? Okay, I'm gonna be I'm gonna be a little soy and do the, the non-creepy auction. Just kidding. Don't be creepy, guys. It's absolutely right. Yeah, I spit facts. I'm a real one. But it's this great artistic potential. I especially love that like giant plot of, of farm that is completely overgrown. Although I have to admit, it's not easy to pay the bills as an artist. Oh yeah, I'm an artist. I'm struggling big time. A fishing artiste. We have an art show where you sell your art on the internet. I mean, realistically, I would be sell your art on the internet because, like, you're probably gonna make more money, but this one's cooler, so I'm gonna do that one. Unlocks my structures, I'd be crushed. Uh, you gotta move on then, man. Quit art. It's that easy. Just kidding. <laughs> I'm sorry, guys. I'm not actually this mean. I'm actually really nice. Have to think about it? Yep. Next stop by my pleasure. My pleasure. Is she actually in here? Or is that just a cutscene? She is actually in here. Nice. Take a salad. Yeah, it is a bold idea. Also, it'd be a bold idea if you could freaking increase in hearts, man. Oh yeah, dude, I keep forgetting about Caroline. I need to make friends with Caroline too. I need to make that a habit. Because I really want to make a lot of money by selling all of my seeds. I'm running out of daffodils, man. That is bad. Because I don't think I have any other liked gifts. Especially not gold quality. I mean, it looks like she's relatively high up. Because she's the fifth. But she doesn't even have a heart yet. I think I only need two hearts, though, so that's not that bad. Well, well, well. Isn't it the consequences of my actions? Closed on Wednesdays. Does Caroline, like, ever leave her home? I don't really, I'm not really familiar with her schedule. Nope, she does not leave her house when it rains. Damn it. I'll just hang on to this daffodil for later. Okay, this is, like, the best possible infested floor I could get. Because there's literally just so many tiles where stuff can spawn. Also, hey, a special slime, cool. I mean, a wooden mallet would have been nice, but I don't really need it now. Unlucky. Level 7 foraging. Tree fertilizer is nice, and we can make winter seeds, and warp turn in the mountain. That's actually not that bad. How do we make those? I feel like they probably won't be that practical because they're probably going to be pricey, but eh, it's not that bad. Yeah, we'll see. We'll see. I think I'm also going to sell a bunch of bars so I can buy the greenhouse. 
And we're kind of balling with bars right now, so I don't really care. If we have not that many right now, because we can just farm up a bunch more easily. Okie dokie, are we gonna have enough money? We have a lot of bars. We have just enough. We're gonna be poor as hell though. Whatever, we'll just sell this random stuff. I don't really want them in my inventory. Okay, so I I guess let's go buy the greenhouse. Hello, man. I would like to destroy the town. This is hopefully gonna make us money. I would be very sad if it makes us like nothing. Okay, right now we're gonna work on farming up a ton of clay. Uh, if you don't know, we're gonna use a method called clay farming. I'm gonna try to farm up maybe like 50 clay, something, something like that. As far as I know, the beach is the best way to do it. So here's like a cool time lapse or edit of me doing it because it's gonna be very awesome. Okay, it took most of the day, but I got 43 clay. It was pretty easy, so I might do it again. Shout out to Joe TG for making the video that I used. Uh, his video will be linked in the description. It's pretty simple, so you could definitely do it yourself. You just gotta go carefully, since if you do miss how even once, it kind of messes up the pattern. But don't be intimidated. Clay farming is pretty easy. If you use that guide, it obviously can get a lot more complicated, though. We needed that clay, so we could make our lovely garden pots. Oh no, Caroline's making a run for it. She sees me, but she is too slow. Enjoy this. Appear to kick dinner. Nah, man, that guy does nothing. Also, we're up to one heart, so we are almost at the tea room. The next couple of days are going to be nothing but garden pot grinding, because I want to get like a massive farm. I also need more money, since I think I'm going to try to transform the quarry, maybe, into a place where I can put garden pots, but I feel like that might be a little bit wasteful, because the quarry could actually just be useful for me. But honestly, past the first mystic stone it spawns in, it's, it's, it's not. There we go. We got these two lovely gentlemen and the sketchy looking ass guy. Like, why does he look like he's like being a criminal? Like, he, he's doing something good. He's helping me. That should be his top priority. He should just build me everything for free. All right, let's go ahead and get the recipe. There we go. Got this chick to give us a garden pot. Let's go. Okay, clay, stone, and refined quartz. We have a lot of all of that, so let's get farming, man. The thing is, I kind of have to think long term. I don't want to throw down a ton of them and then realize later, oh, wait, I actually want to move them because I'd have to tear up a ton of crops. I think I'm gonna focus on putting regrowable crops in as well, since that just seems like a better long-term investment. But yeah, let's see how many we can make. Refined quartz is the limit right now, and we have 31. So I'm just gonna take a quick look at Wickedy Chickadees, walk paths, and see where we can place them somewhere convenient. Okay, I think I've decided my location. Okay, one thing we need to check is do sprinklers work off farm? I'm gonna boot up another instance of Stardew Valley and double check really quickly, because I'm definitely gonna use sprinklers if I can but I don't want to waste all my copper and iron because, man, I just need more refined quartz. Okay, we, no, we, we need to do a little bit of quartz grinding because I don't want to waste on basic, and I was going to just make basic, but I feel like it's just way better of an investment to make quality. All right, we got some place down. Let's see if it actually waters them. I will be very, very sad if it does not water them. Please water them. Okay, I don't care, Abigail. Whatever, subscribe, blah, blah, blah. Subscribe, who? Creative plug. And it's goddamn raining, so I can't even tell. Are you serious, man? God damn it, it doesn't work. Okay, 31 blueberry seeds. Okay, well, I already made more because I found some refined quartz I didn't use, so I probably should have bought a couple extra. Oh god, wait, I thought I could craft fertilizer, but I think I have to go buy it. Oh man, okay, no, it's fine. I'll only use fertilizer on some other ones because I can't craft them yet. When I level up, I'll do it, it's not a problem. Must be planted on a farm? Are you serious right now? Okay, I'm not gonna panic and cry yet because maybe it'll let me do it in here? Oh God, I really hope so. I will be very sad. Oh my God, okay, it lets me thank the good Lord. Wow, I planted these really poorly. Wait, maybe that means sprinklers will work. I'm gonna check again. No, okay, sprinklers still do not work, but that's, that's, I'm very happy I can use these because I would be very sad if I could not. Well, we're gonna have to buy some more blueberries tomorrow. I'm gonna be very sad because they're gonna be out of sync, man, but it's fine. I'm really getting kind of picky. I got farming, man. I should be thanking my lucky stars. Wait, I didn't check if... Dude, if people walk there, I'm going to... Okay, thank God. They're safe zones. You'll love to see it. All right, my current objective right now is going to be farm up more resources so I can make more pots, as well as try to get more dwarf scrolls. I'm going to try to get the second one right now because I have one in three, and I'd love to be able to speak to the dwarf. I think it would just be kind of cool, you know, make another friend. Since he hangs out near me, I can make friends with him pretty easy. I think I need to invest some money in salads because I am low energy. I'm bothering to mine all these big rocks since it's free stone. It's basically like, hey, I get 10 stone per. That's just a garden pot, so... 
All right, we got plenty more. I do kind of, I just need more money, man. I need money and I need money fast. Might have to do another fish grind today because I need money. I'm going to water all my crops when I add to them. I have not forgotten. Don't worry. I'm just going to go bankrupt on blueberry seeds because I'm pretty sure I'll be planting a lot more in the coming days. Okay, but we need money because tomorrow is the traveling cart and I think I'm going to buy a sweet gem berry seed. To be honest, I'm not sure if I can even plant them in garden pots because I know you can't do ancient fruit in garden pots. But if I could do a sweet gem berry, that would be nice because I could get a star drop. Okay, everything is planted and watered. And this is going to be very nice. It's going to drain a little bit of my energy, but I just need to make money, buy salad, so I don't have to worry about energy anymore. It's going to be a super nice cash injection every couple of days because I really want to afford to go over here because it's kind of nice to have. It's a lot of space. I could, I could do something there maybe. 243 dust sprites. I'm going to farm up a couple more. I really want to get the dust sprites done. I might just dedicate the entirety of tomorrow to it, to be honest. Oh, this is awkward. I'm trying to open my geodes and I literally do not have the money. I'll be right back. <laughs> I'm going to sell my fish. That's actually the biggest L of all time to not have enough money to open geodes <laughs> on the 21st of summer, year one. Now that that is out of the way, I got two more chores to do. And then I'm going to focus up on getting that damn burglar's ring because I want it so bad. Okie dokie, rare seed acquired, money for a battery pack, so I may as well buy it since that's the cheapest I've seen one by far, thousand bucks cheaper. And yeah, I'm gonna need them because I do want to go to Ginger Island. Okay, the trees are getting there. I don't think I'm gonna bother chopping these all down until I get a golden axe since that would just break me. I hunted down Leah and found her. Oh, I thought I was trying to talk to her. Okay, never mind. Sorry. I thought um <laughs> there was more dialogue, but I was trying to spam through it. <laughs> Okie dokie, let's see if we can plant these. We can plant them. Okay, so we're going to be able to get another star drop. That is massive, huge, ginormous even. Fun guy. I just deleted the dude. Uh... Okay, that's fine. I haven't done that much today. I'm so glad I didn't like accidentally do that like at the end of the day. Okay, another gift. Caroline is probably pretty close to two hearts. Maybe one or two more gifts will do it for her. We're gonna be able to make a lot of money. That's gonna be a good amount of money because right now we are struggling big time with cash. Oh, no way. Dwarf scroll number two. Okay, nice. And I think we're actually getting really close to um, unlocking the burglar's ring, which would be very cool. Level nine mining. We're actually about to hit <laughs> level 10. It's gonna take a while, obviously, but we're actually getting surprisingly close. Also, oh god, we are running out of clay. Okay, I think my goal right now is going to be let's get 40k gold and go to the desert. Which I think, unfortunately enough, is probably going to mean more fishing. <laughs> I have spent way too much time fishing on the save, man. I'm going to cry. Although, we are going to get a bunch of money once we finally make two hearts with Caroline and can get tea saplings. Does it always have these green leaves in the secret woods? If yes, I'm blind. But they look really nice, I'm not gonna lie. Okay, I need to remove these bombs from my hotbar. Because I am 100% gonna accidentally bomb something. I need to put them the hell away. Boom, we're up to four hearts with Leah. That's kind of good, actually. I'm, I'm proud of myself. I'm gonna start dating her. And I think I probably will try to marry her. Even though I'm gonna have to spend, like, so much money on a house that I literally cannot use. And it's goddamn Wednesday, so freaking Caroline is gonna come out. Because Caroline's a fake. We did it unfortunately we did it 10 minutes past when the shop closes also holy ruby but yeah for some reason the game started giving me like literally everything except dust sprites but yeah it was a pretty huge day we got like 100 iron 50 copper too which is kind of nutty okay we're running out of clay again man okay i think i need to go fishing because i need fast money fast as the name implies let's go Finally, I got the goddamn garbage hat, dude. I have been waiting for this for so damn long. I am very pleased I got it. Really completes the look. Yo, I missed the triple hardwood for every stump by one hardwood. That's unlucky. What about an 18 hardwood could have my perk? That would have been kind of huge. I, I feel like I'm pretty sure I have enough artifacts don donated, except I don't think Gunther comes on rainy days. So I want it to not rain so I can go get stuff man kind of sad that this rain doesn't affect my crops indoors i still have to water them even if it does rain 
but it's gonna be worth it because I'm going to make a bank. It looks like they're getting close to, okay, I'll say relatively close to being done, which I'm very excited for. I'm not gonna lie, I think today might have to be another garden pot grind today because I wanna have lots of garden pots ready for cranberries because I'm relatively, I'm like 50-50 that cranberries make more money than blueberries. So I'd like to plant those. And I'm 95% sure if these crops die when the season changes, I'm going to actually sob. But I don't think they will. <laughs> Surely they won't. Oh my god, the lightning strike timed the furnace's ending. That's crazy. Look at how many ores I have. 26 gold, 60, 173 coal. Kind of insane. Well, another quartz grind day. It's fine. I'm used to hard days of work. I've been recording for four hours, by the way, just so you know. Oh my gosh, wait. I just had a genius idea. Fire quartz only takes a day to generate. So if I get a fire quartz and put it in my crystallarium, I can get minimum three refined quartz per day. That could be massive. I'm not going to lie. All right, that's objective number one. We need to find a goddamn fire quartz. Actually, I'm going to double check. Maybe normal quartz. Ooh, normal quartz is only seven hours. But here's the thing. I don't think I'm going to be able to check the crystallarium once every seven hours. So the question is, would it be better for me to do a fire quartz and just collect it like every day than have it to run back to the farm every seven hours? I feel like fire quartz makes more sense, but I could be wrong. But that kind of makes sense in my, in my head. So I think I'm going to do fire quartz. Assuming I can find them and not just copious amounts of gold. I mean, I won't complain about the gold, but holy smokes, this is a lot of gold. All right, Jade, you had a good run, little bro, but unfortunately, the future is coming for us all, and you are being replaced by a fire quartz. I have farmed an insane amount of quartz today. However, we're not done the grind set today. I'm going to go and see if I can also farm up a ton of clay as well. Cause then I can make so many garden pots. Cause I got, I, I got like 21 or something, 21 quartz or something crazy like that. Doesn't seem like that much, but that's a lot. And right now we're limited by refined quartz, but we could be limited by clay tomorrow. If that makes sense, it doesn't, but I'm just going to roll with it. That's kind of the motto of the Wooly Goat channel. It doesn't make sense, but we'll, let's, let's roll with it. Okay, I did my best, but I only got 19, which actually might be like the perfect amount. I honestly don't know, but I'm going to go home and take a little sleep. Level 7 combat. Ring of Yoba I normally use, but honestly, I'd rather have Burglar Ring plus a little bit of magnetism. And also, holy smokes, we are just so rich right now. Like, we just have so many resources. Thousands of wood, stone, we have... 300 hardwood, almost 700 fiber. That's all going to be gone once we get tea saplings. But, oh, it's my daily quartz delivery. That's going to be, I mean, it's going to be around like roughly 6 a.m. every day. So I can just pick it up while I water all my crops. That is lovely and exactly what I wanted. These trees are starting to grow up pretty dang well. So I guess we're going to do a big chopping session soon. I think I'm going to start cutting down these oak trees and maybe work on an oak resin farm. I really need anything, everything to fall in the water except the acorns. Kind of sad I'm going to lose so much wood, but I can live with it. It's fine. This guy has the audacity to destroy one of my damn trees. I hate this guy. Screw Elliot. And I think I'm going to make a big investment here and actually make some tree fertilizer. Okie dokie, my oak farm is ready to go smelting up a couple more bars. Two hearts with Caroline. Okay, I think... I unlock her room. I'm like 95% sure. I've actually never unlocked these these tea leaves, but uh, hopefully it's easy because I, I want it fast. My favorite festival. Let's go, dude. I love this festival so much. It is just such a vibe. I just, I love everything about it. It is my favorite. Bro really wants to eat the jellies. Wait, disappoint? I don't care, Pam. Don't criticize Gus, little bro. I don't want to talk to anyone. I just want to vibe. Here we go. We vibe in big time. The music kicks in, man. I love it. That was a huge vibe. I love that so much, man. And also, I'm gonna try keep sleeping here, not because like I need to, because I think this is how I need to get the rusty key. I need to like be in the house. And then in theory, if I leave, the leech finally gives me something. You love to see it. And he almost forgets to give me the thing, dude. I hate this guy so much. Holy. <laughs> I 
I think I might want to upgrade my watering can soon. It is getting kind of annoying individually watering every crop. I'm over it. Might need a copper. But honestly, I don't even know if copper would help that much, especially for ones like this. It might just make the animation canceling harder. Okay, I'm just gonna update my tree farm. Hopefully go get the tea sapling recipe and uh, buy some crops with the, with the money I get from the tea saplings because we're gonna be balling the hell out. Then we can check out the lovely sewers and meet our good friend Krobus. Okay, I think I need to like go into the tea room and then I'll get it or something. Does it let me in? It does. I don't care. Just give me the recipe. Sorry, little bro. Did I get it? Oh, the next day I get the recipe. Okay. Also, I probably shouldn't have skipped that. There probably was like an interaction. Also, that kind of ruins my plans because now I have literally no money. Okay, let's go catch that legendary fish. I'm gonna hope I can do it without a trap bobber, but I probably will fail and have to go buy one. We're in. Let's go, dude. I also gotta save up money and reset my mining skill. Kind of annoying me. Okay, this fish is a lot rarer than I remember because uh, this is like, what, 15 casts and I still haven't gotten it? Okay, we finally got it. I think we're just high enough level to kind of tank. It's just like wrap it up and down because we're gonna slightly stay in it but it might be a little bit close but thankfully these jumps we can kind of just tank and we're good i started with 33 bin we only have eight left that took way too long to get man also are you serious right now 45 energy well to be quite frank i was not anticipating that was gonna take so long i guess i can just go get my oh wait a new friend hey leah how's it going five hearts let's go huge halfway to marriage if that's gonna be a possibility if she like wants to marry me just creepily stand here for a little bit and stare at her why oh, she's coming too close, I'll go away. Nice, new crafting recipe, tea sapling. That is what we need. I also have had a secret money-making method on the back of burner for a little bit. So you're about to see what that is in a couple of days. No, it is not crops. But yeah, let's go ahead and make up like a ton of tea saplings and see how much money we can make from that. I remember it's like pretty damn good money, but I don't remember like exactly how much one sells for. Someone walked over my goddamn furnaces. Man, I, I cannot stand Stardew Valley residents, dude. I guess just negative two furnaces. <laughs> Might have to move my smelting operation because I do not want that happening again. Copper is expensive these days, man. Oh, I am so excited for this. There are a couple of things that are going to be so nice. You built it from scratch. You mean Robin built it from scratch, little bro. Didn't even remember the cutscene I called it. Just saying. Bro actually just goofed out. Yeah, I, I look forward to helping. It's going to be so nice. And Robin loves me. Awesome. Hit me up, man. If you know Demetrius isn't uh isn't really doing it for you anymore, you know what I'm saying? Oh wait, you did a pun. Never mind. Please don't speak to me ever again. I think we're definitely gonna go with a curious substance since the other one gives us fiber seeds. And actually, the more I think about it, that might be kind of useful. Wait, yeah. What the heck do I need monster musk for? Okay, so that was a mistake. Whatever. Who cares? Also, I need wood, not stone. God damn it! I have to go all the way home. I really want to reach level 8 farming. I want coffee so bad, man. At least I'll have a big uh, backlog when I do eventually get to it. All right, how much money will we make? We got 70 seeds. Oh, wait, it's two seeds per. I thought it was one. Okay, well, let's see how much that is. Wow. 17k. Wickedy chickadee. You are absolutely correct. That is a busted money-making method. I think I might have to start farming false seeds. That's actually OP. I should have saved a couple and started scaling. That's insane. Well, I got a couple of decisions of what I can do with this money, but I think for now, what I'm gonna do is just save it and see how much money I have after my crops are ready and I finish up my money-making method. Hopefully, my method will be ready to go tomorrow. Let's see. See you in a day of farming. Can you guys guess what my money-making method is gonna be? Do you think you can guess? Leave a comment if you think you have a guess. But don't cheat, because that'd be cringe. Or if you do cheat, can you put bracket, I cheated, bracket? Like, just to clarify. No shame, no shame. I don't blame you. I know, you want attention, I understand. If you cheat and you do the I cheated bracket, I'll, I'll, I'll give you a heart, okay? If you can't guess now, I, I, I do not know what to say to you. Okay, we're at 17k, how much are we gonna make? Yeah, okay, that's, that's pretty good. Let's do some geos really quick, too. Couple more donations. New reward, let's go. A chair, that is very useless. <laughs> kind of crazy how I've managed to get two skills to level 10 without a farm. And farming level 10 is possible, so I do want to get that at some point. Maybe not this year, though. And now we must make a 10,000 gold investment, unfortunately. But it's going to make us even more money because I'm going to sell all those uh, ores we have. And plus, I want that skill anyway because the gem one's kind of useless. I just wanted to sell all that stuff with a 30% boost because it was kind of stupid. 
It's just plus 30% money. So hopefully after the bars and after the crops, we will be able to unlock the desert and maybe even the quarry. Because if I could get a galaxy sword, that would be very nice. I also need to start preparing for a skull cavern runs, definitely. Hopefully I have enough money to upgrade my axe to gold as well, because I am not looking forward to chopping down all my trees without... I think we actually have enough money to buy something right now. Actually, wait, no. We need to buy crops first. Actually, no. We'll buy this and then we'll buy crops. Mr. Decisive over here. We want the bridge and we still have 10k left over, so who cares? Oh my god. Wait, cranberry seeds are so expensive. I just went bankrupt on cranberry seeds. <laughs> Dude, it's actually unbelievable how fast I go through money in this game. I will be upset if I don't have enough for the desert, but like, Jesus. I had like 47k like moments ago and now I'm down to a whopping 86. <laughs> I think we were at... I think we were at 85 before, so I, I I guess we went up a little bit. I can't wait to have more things to water. I love watering. All right, let's have a little bit of infrastructure here because we're going to be getting this bridge. And I don't want to be walking over so slowly, you know what I'm saying? Even though we do just have the minecart, I just remembered. That's fine. I wanted to do this anyways. <laughs> Shawnee Dew is happy right now all right everything's nice and pathed up so we can move marginally faster we got a nice little bridge popping up out of nowhere and we get plus one ore per vein and metal bars are worth 50 percent more so it's lovely foraging awesome all right since the bridge is finally going to be repaired let's go grab that golden scythe also is there going to be a mystic stone no mystic stone that is so sad well oak trees are very nice because i need more oak saplings I think if I just actually kill the mobs and don't just like run by them, I'll probably be fine. These skulls are gonna be the annoying part. They're actually not, they're not as strong as I thought. Oh, 10%, nah, that's not worth. Can I just dodge these other two? Oh yeah. Also, I see out of the corner of my eyes that the blueberries are ready. Let's go, dude. Okie dokie. Oh my God, we have coffee ready too. Fortunately, we don't have kegs. We're currently <laughs> level zero but I'm sure we'll get there one day. Finally, gonna get some farming money after so long. That puts us up to farming level one. Okay. Oh my gosh, I just finished watering and I am already out of energy. That is kind of crazy. Okay, to be fair, I did chop down some trees, but wow. All right, that's gonna be 15 quarts cooking up. Okay, let's go plant some more acorns. Okay, the trees are starting to grow up, so I think it might be time to buy the golden axe. So I won't cry when I have to cut down like 400 trees. Okay, I think it's time to start preparing a fall chest. So I'm gonna start put some stuff in there that is like rare or valuable. So we can do two of these, do a diamond, two of my legend fish, a golden blueberry. I guess I'll do a purple mushroom as well. How many items is that? I don't know, a salad. <laughs> I, I don't, I feel like I don't really have that much stuff to give. I guess I'll just do some quality fish as well. Let's do these iridium fish I have. Iridium and gold. Okay, I guess that's all the things. Also, holy smokes, where the heck did the day go? I was gonna sell all these blueberries, but now I can't. Okay, well, uh, I guess I'll sell these blueberries tomorrow. <laughs> oh god, I exhausted myself like an idiot. Yippee, level one farming on fall 5th of year one. <laughs> that's insane. All right, we're gonna make big money today since we leveled up our mining. We're gonna sell, like, a bunch of gold bars. I'm gonna leave 15, I think. I'll leave 15 of each. And copper sells for nothing, so I won't bother with that. I'm gonna sell all these random minerals that I've, I have I already own. Because they're just kind of crowding my chest. And I don't really want them. Alright, Clint. How much we getting? Not a whole lot from the gems. A pretty good amount from the bars. How much will those blueberries be, too? I feel like it won't be that much, but it'll be an okay amount. 36,000. That is pretty damn good. I'm not gonna lie. How much does the bus cost again? 40,000. So we need 5,000 more gold. Okay, that's a little bit of a steep order. I'm not gonna lie. I think I'm gonna upgrade my axe today since I want to go and cut down every single tree on the map tomorrow or the day after rather because it takes a day to upgrade. We get a little bit more money from those blueberries. We could buy the bus now, but I want the axe first. Oh yeah. Uh, I guess I'll just get a legendary fish too, since this one is really easy to get. Okay, uh, I forgot to upgrade my axe today, so I'm just gonna say whatever and just and just buy the bus, cause I want to go to the desert. 
Golden axe acquired. I forgot to do it yesterday like an idiot, so I'm doing it now. I think today's objective, since we have no axe, is let's get the, the fourth dwarf scroll. It is gonna be hell, I know, but I really want it. That was so much faster than I thought it would be. This is literally my first time on floor 95. That is kind of crazy. I, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> what the hell? Okay. I guess we can talk to the dwarf now. Awesome. You love to see it. Let's get that donated up. Also, fireworks apparently I haven't donated. Dwarvish translation guide. You love to see it. <laughs> Golden axe. So that is two of our tools at gold, which is pretty dang good. Since that's what, 20? It's like 40k of money invested in invested in the um the tools. Kind of crazy. Okie dokie. It is time to cut trees for the entire day. This is gonna be pain, literally. Okay. That took so long and holy crap. Wait, that's actually insane. I got exactly 999 and 999 wood. No excess. That's insane. I swear to god I didn't I didn't I didn't set that up. That's actually lucky. Like it's not like like significant at all, but like it's kinda cool, I guess. Also, there were loads of uh, blackberries. Okay, I will chop the rest of the trees tomorrow. Level three farming? I could start setting up bee houses that might be kind of cool i don't know i really wish i had gotten this robin resource rush yesterday crap and it was monday i did have it yesterday i'm actually brain dead it's fine i can maybe pull it off it might be a little bit tough because i just chopped like half the trees across the map and i definitely would have gotten enough since there was like a th <laughs> well i got 2000 wood but we still got all of these trees so it might be enough we'll see see you in a couple more minutes of painstaking wood cutting i'm 3000 gold away from getting to the bus and I want to get it today but I have like two hours to do it so to be quite frank I probably will not be able to actually yeah I don't think I'm gonna be able to do it maybe I could do I have anything I can sell here I'm gonna grab all of my fish I can sell a couple of these bars okay we're so close we just gotta make it to Willie before he closes bus acquired thank you Morris love you buddy okay I need a prismatic shard and I want to go to the desert. I think that's gonna be the, the the objective today. I'll grab some blackberries for food as well. I also really just need to level up my goddamn farming, man. I'm telling you. So I'm gonna buy a bunch of star fruit today too. I'm also hoping I can find some more clams because I stupidly spent all of my clams just to sell for like 100 gold when I should have saved them and used speed grow because kind of a goofy recipe, but yeah, I need clams and pine tar. And I have a little bit of pine tar, so that's not the problem. I need clams. 500 gold is expensive, so I really hope I didn't forget anything important. <laughs> I will be very sad. Since I love wood, I'm just going to chop down all these trees here too, because I want to. Hey, what's up, Sandy? Oh my god, she actually like sprinted towards me, Jesus. I'm so excited to spend thousands of dollars on a star-shaped fruit. That's awesome. I can only afford 10. That is literally nothing. I may need more money. Okay, Skull Caverns, let's go. I think my plan is going to be try to murder these slimes so they drop iridium ore. I'm going to kill these serpents in a very careful way. Already farmed up enough iridium for one ore. Let's go. God damn it. Please don't lose anything valuable. Okay, I'd like no money too. That's fine. No way. All my starfruit seeds and my fire quartz. That is actually tragic. I am so sad. At least I have 16 iridium more. That was not worth it even a little bit. Well, we're sitting comfortably at zero gold. <laughs> Just like at the beginning. <laughs> well, we unlocked level A combat, I guess. More HP. <laughs> that would have been nice a couple minutes ago. Oh yeah, cranberries make money. And also this, this finally gives us enough money to buy some more crops after the crippling loss in Skull Caverns. Our pine tar collection, or not pine tar, our oak resin collection has begun. Unfortunately, we are still really, really, really far off from being able to make kegs. But I really want to make coffee, dude. I'm so tired of being slow. I tell ya. Boom, 5,500. And holy smokes, we've made $250,000 without a farm. That is insane. All right, I think I'm going to buy some pumpkin seeds I can plant. Oh, wait, preserve jars. I don't know why, but I just completely forgot about those. Oh, maybe I should do preserve jars instead of kegs. I, I obviously won't make me coffee, but it would still make me some extra money. Yeah, I think that's what I'm going to do. Plus, I just have so much coal. I'm doing it. You're about to see crazy amount of preserve jars. 
Okay, how much do preserve jars cost? Wood, stone, and coal. Okay, we have a pretty good amount of all that. Let's start with 60. Oh my god, that is literally all my coal gone. Why did I do that? Okay, that's fine. Yeah, no, no, that's fine. I'll just, <laughs> I'll spend the rest of the day farming up, uh, farming up, <laughs> farming up some coal. Huh? Huh? Okay, I just loaded in. Please be a bug. Please be a bug. Oh my god, I just had a heart attack. Okay, sorry. I just loaded in. That scared me so bad. Jesus. Okay. Reminder to not sleep in the mines because you will have a heart attack. Okay, I need to... Water everything and then grind up a ton of coal since I'm just completely out of coal. We can also jar these blueberries since I don't really have anything else valuable to jar. Let's get jarred. We're gonna make some solid money from this. Very excited. Okay, we farmed up 280 iron and 63 coal. I'm just gonna leg over to the secret woods, grab my hardwood, sleep there, grab it again in the morning, and then head back up. I don't even know why I farmed up all this. I just kind of feel bad like having like no having having like no copper. It just kind of makes me having no coal just makes me kind of nervous. I just like having it. Gives, gives me peace of mind. The fair is tomorrow. Let's go, dude. And we got our setup prepared. I'm hoping that wins us, uh, wins us all of it, but we'll see. Let's go check up on all my little tree projects. And I think I might also speed grow a couple of... I might speed grow a couple of oak seeds just in case, because... I don't even know if I'm gonna be able to level up enough to get to oak resin kegs, but when I do get to kegs, I don't wanna be limited by anything. I just wanna make as many as possible. Also, these are all gonna be out of sync, but whatever, I don't care. There we go, that's all the oak trees fertilized. Oh yeah, I can't water today because I don't have my watering can. We can miss a day, it doesn't really matter. It's not like all the crops are gonna die, I think. I don't really know how garden pots work to be quite frank, but they shouldn't <laughs> as far as I know. I'm gonna check what you get from each of these quests, and then I'll decide which one I do. Because I think I can do both of them. Because I know I can get 25 gold quality. I think I have enough crops, and it has two weeks, so it's likely. Okay, so I get the farm computer. And wow, that is really useless for me. <laughs> Damn. A mini shipping bin. That is so good. I definitely want that one. Sorry, Demetrius. I hate to, I hate to help out Pierre over you, but I'm um, sorry, man. That is just so much more useful. Yeah, we need to harvest 25. I'm hoping we can do that. I think we should be able to. I'd, I'd, I'd be kind of surprised if we couldn't. Right now, literally everything we need to do needs money. So I think I'm just gonna farm up some more coal for the rest of the day. That way we can hopefully make more jars and make more money. I'm also gonna collect a ton of iron and coal so I can make explosive ammo and hopefully try to make like a descent down into the caverns and get a ton of iridium. Okay, a way less successful day for coal, but but 200 iron is still pretty good. We are gonna have so much iron, it's not even funny. Okie dokie, 75 explosive ammo is an okay start. It just needs so much coal, which is a little annoying, but it's fine. Just gonna leave explosive ammo in there. Okay, time to bed, because we are about to pass out. Well, my axe would be ready today, but unfortunately, it is the fair. Well, not unfortunately, the fair is pretty useful. Wait. I think I might be stupid. I literally didn't bring anything. Okay, I have to restart the day. God damn it. Okay, well, I can't really buy my way out of trouble in this one because I only have $500. So I need to get lucky gamba because otherwise I'm in trouble. All right, we need a star drop. I don't know. Maybe I'll buy those mixed seeds for fun. Okie dokie. Lewis is getting to the judging. I'll chow down on a couple of burgers while I wait. Oh, it's been judged. Come on, I'm feeling lucky, I'm feeling lucky. 101. Okay, that was close, but uh, let's go, dude. That works for me. <laughs> I'll collect all my stuff back up. The heck, holy smokes, there's a there's a wild emo in the town. I've ever seen, that's very impressive. Shut up. Not relevant. Huh, well, uh, if you can tell by the amount of wheels, I just won. That was that was that was pretty lucky. I I guess we just we just have enough enough money to buy everything we want. Wait, let's dominate this real quick. Ready? Boom! It's that easy. Now we should have ten thousand, but we only have nine 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 nine. I am just going to buy everything. Yeah. If you are enjoying, we're pretty far into the video, and I've been grinding the hell out. I have been playing for around four hours at this point, straight in this recording session. And I'm trying to hit like 200K at some point in my life. So please, please subscribe. I would very much appreciate it. If we hit, if we hit 200K, this is a crazy goal that we will never hit. If we hit 200K before the year's end, I will get perfection on this save. We bought everything. Let's get out of here now. 
Panning is complete. So we have beat the Joja Mart. Let's go, dude. We've done it. The glittering boulder is gone. Are we gonna get the Willy cutscene right away? I'm kind of curious, honestly. Oh yeah, we get it. And Willy is just okay. And I'm okay. Sleeping up here, uh, kind of bugs it out. Panning for ore, just what I wanted. Let's go. Extra pan, yeah, I'll take it. Thanks, Willy. Love you, buddy. Pan acquired. Oh, the cutscene. Here we go. We did it. Incredible. We have created the ultimate Joja Joja warehouse in the in in the whole country. Got a big promotion. Awesome sauce. Good for you, Morris. You deserve it, bro. Soda machine. We have it. We get a Joja Cola every day. You love to see it. Just what I wanted. Don't know why I wanted that accent, sorry. Also got the steel watering can. I'm honestly, yeah, I think I'm just gonna try to rush that gold one because I don't think I can deal with it with, with having to waste like all my energy watering for much longer. <laughs> Prismatic slime has been found. Been searching for this guy for quite a while. It's been a couple days. And we get the, <laughs> we get twice the twice the jelly. This is gonna give us the monster musk recipe, which is gonna help me farm up coal since I just have literally like no coal right now. Okay, to be honest, I just couldn't take it anymore. Gold watering can is in the works. Okie dokie. He is rude as hell as expected. I can't throw this out, seriously. I can't drop it either. Wow. I just have a prismatic jelly forever. That's awesome. Holy smokes, wait, 5,000 gold? Oh my god. Wait, I had no idea I got that much money. I just wanted the <laughs> the monster musk. That's actually huge. Oh my good. Oh, Leah wants to talk to me. What does she want? Oh, she brought me a gift. Sculpture I've been working on just for you. Oh my god, that is that is beautiful. I love it. Thank you, Leah. Amazing. Not sure if I should feel insulted if that's how you feel about me, but whatever. All right, monster musk acquired. It's kind of expensive, but we have lots of bad wings and slime, and I don't really think we need them for anything else. Obviously, we would be needing bad wings if we wanted to make, like, lightning rods, but lightning rods do not work off of the farm. So, we're gonna have to get all of the batteries we need to go to Ginger Island from the traveling cart, and I really hope I get lucky, because if I do not, I will be a very sad man. Oh! My god, that is insane. I just panned and got the iridium ore I needed to, <laughs> to finally make the iridium watering can as soon as I have enough money. I am very happy about that. Panning is actually overpowered. What the hell? Okie dokie, we got the golden watering can. And it is going to be 25,000 to make it iridium. I am not going to lie to you. I, I think I might actually want to save for that. Since I've completed Joja Mart, I don't really need the money for that much else. Well, actually, no. I'm going to save it until I have enough to make sure I have all the batteries to go to Ginger Island. Okay, it's only 11 o'clock now. It used to take me to like 1 before I could finish watering. So, absolutely worth it. And today, I literally don't give a damn. I'm buying the Iridium watering can. Holy smokes, dude. I'm actually a rhyme god. Didn't mean me to do that. Wait, there's a festival today? I can't sell anything? Are you kidding? Oh, cool. Just walk through a couple trees. But let's uh, go ahead and talk to the wizard. Yeah, sure, buddy. I can grab that ink for you. It's a no problem. Unfortunately, I cannot start that quest today because there's a festival today. So, I'm just going to work on cutting down all these trees. We have arrived at the spooky happenings. I think I, I, I was about to buy this jack o lantern recipe, then everybody else is 2,000 gold. Screw that, never mind. I've killed like 50 of these guys. They, they are not rare, bro. No one cares. That's a $2,000 pumpkin here and here. They, they, they better be enjoying this, I'm telling you. Blackberries. Honestly, I spoke about berries briefly in another video, and I think blackberries also definitively join the S tier, assuming they're like good blackberries, not like mushy. How do they even make dust? That's just like an that's 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 just like an actual house on legs. Also, fire, so much fire on a leaf maze. I feel like that is just it, it can only go one way, and that is a massive fire that takes out the entire town. I love how on this one you can kind of track your progress based on the light. That is very cool. But yeah, golden pumpkin acquired. Let's go, dude. That's really all I came for. See you later. Oh, this is what I was waiting for. I have all the hardwood, but I'm missing the iridium and I'm missing the batteries. I don't know why, but I just feel like I'm not going to get lucky and I'm not going to have the batteries, but I would be very sad if that is the case. Okay, we're so close to level 8 farming. Please just give me the keg. All I want is speed. It's all I want. It's not a big ask. Speed is tempting, but not for $1,100. That is absurd. 32,000 gold just actually no not even just enough more than enough to get exactly what i need i missed it by 10 minutes again dude 
This place closing actually makes me want to lose it. God, I hate Clint. All right, I'm going to buy a couple pieces of coffee because I have money right now and I'm going to have a lot more money soon. And I'll also buy a couple more salad just to get up to 50. Buy a beer as well. Give it to Pam because I just realized I can get battery packs from Pam. Because she actually has a chance to send battery packs as a gift. And I'm very embarrassed that I didn't remember this. Wickedy Chickadee reminded me when I just asked in a Discord server if I could use lightning rods off the farm. Just to double check. So, uh, shout out Wickedy. You're a real one for that. Okay. Might have accidentally spent all of my coal on... <laughs> On uh, explosive ammo again, because I was crafting 25 at a time instead of 5 at a time, but that's fine. Just gonna start putting stuff that I need in there. Probably should have traded this in for 8 staircases, but uh, hindsight is... Hindsight is everything. Good one. Well, I changed my mind. Tomorrow the pickaxe is gonna go up to iridium quality. I'm just gonna deal with gold. It's honestly pretty good for me right now. And then we are going to attempt to dominate Skull Cavern so I can finally have a good amount of iridium. I can maybe even sell some. 35,000 gold. Holy smokes, that is really good. I'm trying to think if there's anything else I need for my for my mining trip. Okay, I'm just going to make five staircases. Nothing crazy. I just want a couple since I forgot to trade them to the desert trader like an idiot yesterday. All right, we pull up. We buy a warp totem. All right, I just bankrupted myself on bombs. I really don't care. I am poor again, but this is going to be... The most banging Gold Caverns run you guys are ever going to see. Especially considering I was homeless. Or, sorry, am homeless. Oh my god, level 8 farming. But we can't do that today because we need to focus up and go do a banger Skull Cavern run. Alright, we're off to the desert. I hope it's good luck day. I am willing to restart the I don't know why I don't drink my coffee. We definitely drink these. Alright, we have pretty decent pace right now. Oh my god, our first Iridium node. I was hoping we get a Prismatic Shard, but I'm happy. I'm not gonna lie, I'm kind of focusing, so might not get a ton of commentary. Eight levels, that is a big W. Okay, I'm not gonna lie, we're kind of swagging out right now. We're just gonna eat once or twice, because I don't want to die like an idiot, because this is a solid run. Floor 36 by 940 is kind of crazy pace, honestly. Oh my god, wait. I can get batteries from these guys. I completely forgot. I can get batteries from these guys. Oh my god, wait, we can get a ginger island now. This floor is wasting way too much of my time, though. I need to get out. And the ladder is hiding up here because it's a freaking stupid ladder. This floor is screwing me over. There's actually not a single ladder. What is going on? Here we go, finally. All right, quick update. We're on floor 142 with 273 iridium. We're swagging out. I'm not even going to lie to you. We are rich as hell. Three prismatic shards. That's also nutty. I just left a prismatic shard and got a... I am so upset. Probably biggest downgrade of all time. Whatever. Negative 100 stone. I don't really care. I want to keep going. I'm having fun. Okay, we swagged the hell out and we're passing out now. That was a super fun run where I got so much baller stuff. Look at this stuff. One Iridium more off a comedic number. We got five prismatic shards, 123 gold. We got two batteries. We just need two more and then we can go to Ginger Freaking Island. That's over 84 Iridium bars. It's just five fire quartz. It's, it's literally just too easy for a guy like me. Also, we get a sewing machine. Let's go, Emily. Love you. And we don't get the sewing machine, actually, because because we had a full inventory. Okay, never mind. And we get 10,000 gold from Mr. Key. It's literally that easy. I love Mr. Chi, dude. He's one of my favorites of all time. And also Krobus this year. Awesome. But yeah, seriously, shout out to Mr. QI. I love that dude so much. Holy smokes. 10k gold is actually nothing to scoff at in a challenge like this. We've all been waiting for this time for so long. And like, sure, I already bought some coffee. But we're going to have infinite coffee now. We got 42... We can make 37. We are ballin'. I tore out a couple of trees because I have nowhere else to put these kegs. And I'm pretty confident they won't get destroyed here. Basically, we just need to keg and smelt so much stuff today. And we also need a lot of copper. So I think I'm gonna go farm up copper for a little bit while all this stuff uh, processes up. Also gonna go grab the galaxy sword today. Definitely don't want to forget that. Because it's kind of a W that we finally managed to snag it. We have acquired... The galaxy sword. Oh my god. I'm actually so proud I got this. I'm not even gonna lie to you guys. It might not be the best weapon. The galaxy armor is definitely better. But, I mean, it's still pretty cool that I managed to get it. When I had, like, literally nothing, like, a year ago. 
All right, today we're going to be trying to hit level 50 in the Skull Caverns, so hopefully we can get some more batteries. We just need two more. Honestly, I think that's going to be pretty doable, but we'll see. Huh, well, I've only gotten one battery pack, but I have gotten a prismatic shard now. <laughs> uh, cool, I guess. Don't really need them, but it's okay. Yippee! A slammer that I do not need. Goodbye. I'll keep my other one because it's the OG, but I do not want another slammer. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, we've got the battery. Get yeah, me out. I'm done. Okay. Wait, these lucky lunches are 100% worth grabbing. Are you serious? I'm 100% grabbing that. Okay, we have just enough solar essence to craft. All right, we got a cookout kit. What we're gonna do with this bad boy is 25 triple shot espresso. You love to see it. All right, the slammer's going away in the chest. He's been he's been a great a great guy, but we got the galaxy sword now. I'm sorry. Five iridium bars and five battery packs. All materials have been found. It will be repaired overnight. Don't mind me just doing a little bit of clay farming, except with winter forageables. Okay, that's probably all I want for now. I just wanted a couple of items. I totally just didn't mess it up. No, but seriously, I did only really want these items because I want to make a bunch of winter. Question is, can I find a bunch of crystal fruit and crocus now? That is, might be a problem. Oh, both of them. Awesome. You love to see it. Okay, <laughs> a second red cabbage seed, dude, and a battery pack. You cannot make this stuff up. There is just no shot. <laughs> I love this game. And I don't really care. I'm burning through all my spicy eel. I want some gosh darn speed, man. I just realized I had a couple more fall seeds. So I made a couple more saplings. I think I might actually have enough for just a couple more. Oh my God, this is gonna be so close. There's Caroline. Hey, Caroline. Don't mind me just laying it to your house. Come on, let me in, let me in, let me in. Okay, we're good. Plus 5K and also I have this now. I don't want this. Okay, okay, okay. It's the day, it's the day. I don't have enough money. No shot, wait, wait, wait. guys. Guys, 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 I'm pretending. Um, what do I do? I'm gonna go sell a prismatic shard. <laughs> oh my god. How is it even possible to be this dumb? I actually don't understand. And I don't care, I... Oh my god. Literally the biggest sell of all time. Okay, 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 it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. All right, we're gonna sell some Iridium Bars. All right, plus 9,000 gold. That's what we need. Okay, we only lost like an hour of time. I'm kind of stupid that... I forgot that you needed to pay to go. I'm kind of just used to having like a warp totem that instantly teleports me there. But I think, in my opinion, it's an honest mistake. It could happen to anyone even. I'm going to go out on a limb and say that, yeah, no, no, no. Yeah, I'm saying it. It could happen to anyone. Okay, now take me. I don't care. Good as new. True. Skip. We're going to watch this. Cause we're going to watch this though, because it's kind of cool. We've done it. We have arrived. Hey, little boy. I really wish I'd phrased that differently. My bad, guys. All right, we're going to be speedrunning this. Skipping that stupid cutscene. Go, 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 go. One. All right, epic golden walnut montage. Go. We reached the peak of the volcano. That was pretty easy. I'm not even going to lie. All right, let's hope I get some good enchants. Powerful. That's great. Let's do axe too. Efficient. That's not that good, but it's okay. I can live with that. 10 walnuts. I will take it. Puts me a little bit closer to finally owning a home. A beautiful farm. You love it. All right, that was a good first day. We're up to 12 walnuts. Let's just take a quick nap. Oh, we have a snowy tent even though it's on the island. That's kind of funny. <laughs> oh my god, I did it. I was so unsure. I thought I actually messed it up on that last one because you saw me like pause for a second there. <laughs> but I did it. We've done it. We finally... We finally have a home. Well, only one thing to do. Wait, before you go, click on this video on screen to get a little bit of context on what happened in spring. You'll definitely enjoy it if you enjoyed this one. And I mean, you're all the way here. You may as well.